All right, first things first, hit like and subscribe, you. First thing to do uh, in order to do the uh, unit weight test is you need a tear weight. Seven point six zero pounds. You're going to need to weigh the mass of the uh, empty bucket. We're then going to dampen our equipment. to mix and combine the concrete so that it's thoroughly mixed. You're then going to begin to fill the measure in three equal layers. shovel or scoop around so that we can uh, distribute the concrete. Notice I did not strike the bottom of the uh, container, the receptacle. 10 to 15 times. Notice that I count out loud the whole time. That eliminates confusion. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, and twenty-five. I'm gonna close any voids created by the rod. And our final layer. Approximately into our previous layer. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18 20, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, and 25. Close any voids created. In all honesty, they'd rather you take a few extra minutes to make sure that you've got this done correctly than to fail it, because then you're wasting time. Clean around the entire 
entire lift. They're going to make you actually do the math. I'll put the math on here in just a second and show you how to make the calculation. Make sure I got any deleterious material off of it. I'm then going to dampen the inside of the measure, making sure I get that kind of clean. Unfortunately, it was put away dirty. It's okay though. Open both pet chocks. Twist a little bit. And then you're going to close it on opposite sides. I'm going to bleed the valve, make sure that there's no air left in the cylinder. Once I'm sure that that is the case, I'm going to fill it up with water. Be careful to keep it. Wait, I'm not jamming it in the hole. I'm just allowing water to go in so that I don't inadvertently inject air into the apparatus. Notice that water is now coming out from the other side. I'm going to wrap it to make sure that any air is dislodged and comes out the other pet cup. I've done that sure that everything is set. I'm now going to pump it up to the initial pressure. In this case, I'm going to choose the initial pressure of three. I'm going to settle with the gauge, make sure that it's settled. I'm now ready to perform the uh, air content test. I'm going to hold down the release valve. Continuing to hold down while I make sure that it's settled, I'm going to report my reading as 0.80% air. I'll give myself an aggregate correction factor of 0.20, so I will then subtract 0.20 from 0.80, giving me 0.60% air. I will now open both pet cocks. Making sure that we've ejected that. Make sure that you clean your equipment. I hope you've enjoyed it. Like and subscribe.